Thought I'd show you how to build a riser out of this funny tube. See this from Rainbird? Uh, this is a half inch 90 with a barb on it. Push this in here and you can start to rotate. Because the barbs are in the shape of threads. Uh, I like to cut my tubes eight inches long. I'm gonna use a half inch at the other head at the other end. This is for spray heads, which I have a half inch receptacle, female. This is gonna go in the middle of a um of a line so it's going to attach into one of these. Uh, first you need some Teflon tape. This side is going to get a 90. This is a 90 half inch to half inch. That's what's going to go up into the sprinkler head. Um, I like to cap mine off first so I can test the lines before I put sprinkler heads on. So I'm going to use a cap and I'll loosen this up once they're in the ground. Let all the air bleed out and then tighten them down to make sure that the line is watertight. Then I'll go ahead and cover up most of the line, and I'll put the heads in last. Uh, this is 3 quarter inch PVC right there. That's what this line is. So, there you have it. You can prepare your risers first, and then when it's time to build the sprinklers out in the yard, you just drop them right in. Here's the ones I need for the line I'm doing. And there you go. It's an 8 inch uh, riser using funny tube.